नाही मी जरा एडिट करायला तुम्हाला टाकले होते कॉपी करून ओके फ्रेंड्स प्लीज सबमिट युअर अटेंडन्स इन चॅट बॉक्स पार्टिसिपंट हु जॉईन इड लेट प्लीज सेंड युअर अटेंडन्स इन चॅट बॉक्स आय एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट द लेक्चर फ्रेंड्स कॅन आय ऍडिबल वेल येस सर व्हेरी नाईस सानिका थँक यू योगेश योगेश म्यूट कर तुला प्लीज म्यूट योगेश थँक्स योगेश थँक्स व्हेरी नाईस इंद्रजीत पाडळकर प्लीज म्यूट युअर सेल्फ पाडळकर प्लीज म्यूट युअर सेल्फ ऍडमिन हु इज द वन ऑफ द ऍडमिन ऍडमिन प्लीज म्यूट युअर सेल्फ इंद्रजीत पाडळकर प्लीज म्यूट युअर सेल्फ इंद्रजीत and admin indrajit indrajit okay. please mute yourself indrajit padalkar please mute yourself ओके फ्रेंड्स प्लीज सेंड युअर अटेंडन्स इन चॅट बॉक्स पार्टिसिपंट हो जॉईन इड लेट प्लीज सेंड युअर अटेंडन्स इन चॅट बॉक्स ओके जॉईन फास्ट send message to whatsapp group that is lecture is started on please join fast join fast please submit your attendance in chat box okay friends i am starting now the lecture i am going to share the screen friends is the screen is visible send message in chat box its screen is visible okay i know is it visible
okay friends in last lecture we came to the the central force field if the particle is present in central force field then how the what are the condition when the force that is the central force field is greater than zero and if the uh, what is the condition when the force uh, central force field is greater than uh, less than zero we know that there are the three uh, important conditions uh, properties that will be hold good when the uh, particle is present in the particle is present in central force field that is the these are the three properties which are hold good when the path of the particle must be plane or the curve that is the path of the particle of the rotation it will be the one of the plane and it will be the path will be curved second is angular moment of the particle is conserved angular momentum should be constant with the respect to time and third one is the particle moves particle moves in such a way that a position vector position vector means the aerial velocity from the origin uh, swap swap out the equal area in equal time means that the motion of the particle or the uh, or the or the or the area swept by the particle in same time it will be the same that will be known as an aerial velocity of the particle should be same and after world we came to the mathematical relation that is we will restrict to conservative central force that is the central force is conservative where the potential energy we know that the potential energy is the vr potential energy it will be indicated by the v vr is the function of the r only and hence the force is always directed toward the r means that the force is always directed in between the origin and the uh, radius dist radi radius vector that will be the r as the potential potential energy is the function of the radius vector r that is the function of the radius vector r hence the force is always directed along the r then the central force field central force f vector of a r is equal to unit vector n into f r <coughs> see here this relation that is f vector into r that is the force of a radius vector that is that will be equal to unit vector along r into f r see since the central force is conservative you know that central force is conservative that is f r is equal to minus by the minus because it is directed toward the origin and the origin kada directed aslyamula tacha jo tacha je direction hai te direction downward hai tyamule minus del vector dot v r asa mantlela hai where the v r is the scalar function you know that that is the potential energy is the scalar function and the curl of the gradient of a scalar function curl cos product of the gradient cross product of gradient function he aplyala kay milte sanga it will be zero that is the that is the del cross cross function hai ani gradient hai baka that is del v r is equal to zero tyamule ya del v badal apan fr put up kele tar ite zero milte ani ya relation varun aplyala kay dishte sanga that is the central force field friends Uh, i make it uh, red that is the central force field whose magnitude is the function of the distance that is we know that the force field is the magnitude of the radius vector and radius vector uh, hence it will be it will be conclude that the central force field whose magnitude is the function of the distance from the center of the conservative one and for which the principle of conservation of total energy holds good means that means that that is the principle of conservation of the energy conservation of the energy will be applied here or it will be uh, satisfied here and that will be said that that will be the condition will be said that that is for which the principle of the conservation of the total energy holds good this is the thing that will be uh, that will be uh, satisfied by the central force field friend we know that one another thing is the conservation of angular momentum that is the angular momentum should be constant or it will be conservative and it will be explained by the uh, it will be it will be also uh, uh, it will be also satisfied by the central force field that is the conservation of the angular momentum conservation of angular momentum here see here if the particle is moving under the influence of the force we know that that the particle is moving in uh, moving under the 
under the influence of the central force field just i am going back to the diagram this is the diagram of the central force field see here this is the central force field that is the o is the center of the force and this is the mass of the particle is the m and this is the position of the particle this is the radius vector that is the r vector and here we know that is the f of the uh, f vector of the r that is the force of the radius vector that will be known as a central force field and we know that this uh, uh, this particle is moving with the same velocity in same velocity in three dimensional system around the uh, around the center of the force field and that will be conservative here we are going to say that what is the conservative that is the momentum is the conservative consider that particle that particle which having the mass m is under the influence of the central force field it is under this influence of or under the effect of the central force field in three dimensional system then we know that that is the f vector of the r r is the radius vector is equal to unit vector of the fr that will be the true that will be holds good that will be seen in above equation okay so that the torque acting on torque acting on a radius vector friend see here which is the torque torque is the force we know that and that force is equal but uh, equal in magnitude but opposite in direction it will be apply on a radius vector consider me friends this is the radius vector just i am getting uh, the animations see here this is the radius vector on this radius vector here is the force is the applied in this direction that is force f this is the force f or the f1 this is the force m and in this direction there is the force f dash and this will be known as an torque it will be known as an torque see here the f and f dash have equal in magnitude but opposite in direction and such a type of the force which was which was acting on the radius vector or or which was acting on one of the uh, line that will be known as a uh, torque and that torque we are going to see that torque friends we are going to see the torque just i am take the eraser friend first
ये अविनाश अविनाश जरा इकडे तिथलं हे गेली काय वगैरे रेंज गेली काय बघ जरा बहुतेक नेट गेलो होत नाही झाला आज पहिले हे जिथं का होते नाही लिंक मध्ये झालं बघा एक काम करतो मी दुसरीच लिंक टाकावी लागेल मला असं वाटाय लागलं लिंक का लगे ना ये ना सर हे वाजले किती रे बाजले वाजले बारा वीस झाले ना सर बारा वीस ओके कॉपी ऑन क्लिप बोर्ड म्हणू का काय म्हणू इन व्हाईट म्हणू पार्टिसिपंट इन व्हाईट नव्हे ह्याच्यामध्ये जायला पाहिजे ना सर लिंक काढताना कशामध्ये जायला पाहिजे आपल्याला शेड्यूल म्हणून नाही इन्व्हाइट म्हणून व्हाईट इमेल जीमेल सर आवर फास्ट टाकतो तुला लिंक म्हणून काहीतरी झाले जरा ह्याला झोमलं असणार झोमलं झाले ते झाले की बी एस पी बी एस पी सेंट
बोल लिंक दिस्ते चला एडमिट हो एडमिट हो आवाज ये तो एक एक कस मिनट एक मिनट बारा करते कि मैं एक मिनट हाँ ओके 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 सिक्सर दो बारा एडमिट हो मुझे भी खासी गाओ कुंतरा फ्रेंड्स ओके फ्रेंड्स आवाज ये तो है मज़ा तेजस तेजस मगर सा चार्ट बॉक्स से उन्हें जाना तेजस म्यूट आल के लिए की कहेंगे ओके मित्रों आवाज ये तो है का मज़ा अटेन्डन्स टाका फास्टली अपन सुरू कर लगे मधे इंटरनेट गे अपनी कनेक्शन सगे गेले मैं नवीन लिंक टाक है लगे मैसेज टाक तेजस या नवीन लिंक लॉइन वा मन तेजस हाँ सर गिव मैसेज ऑन व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप टू जॉइन अगेन एंड प्लीज सेंड योर अटेंडेंस इन चैट बॉक्स मगर अटेंडेंस मी सेव करने अगोदर अपन बाहर पड़लो पर करा अपन थोड़ा वे घूमे पूछे लेक्चर कि लेक्चर कि फास्टली going back to share the screen friends screen is visible yes sir yes okay mayuri thank you we are just came to here that is the conservation of the angular momentum and if the particle is under the influence of the central force field then the uh, f vector r is equal to n vector dot f vector r okay then we know the torque torque is the uh, two forces which was uh, uh, acting on the line with the same magnitude but opposite in direction and the so torque acting uh, acting on the radius vector is given by the radius vector r is equal to dl by dt dl by dt it is equal to r is the radius vector okay that is the n vector is the radius vector into uh, cross of kai zala baka f vector into r zala ata f vector into r magashi is mahit hai aplyala f vector into r barobar kai hai n vector dot f vector into r hai ani te put kela mitrano he je put kela he ita hai na te ita apan put kela baka that is n vector into f r aplyala mahit hai which is equal to zero manje it r vector and unit n vector he doge ek mekala perpendicular paije that is the unit vector unit vector that is n vector is the unit vector along r vector and hence r vector cross n vector is equal to zero it means the they are perpendicular to each other that is r vector is equal to r vector barobar kay zala baka it r vector is equal to dl by d2 dl by dt is equal to 
what is the l l is the angular momentum and a d by dt of l that is the derivative of the angular momentum and we know that derivative of angular momentum angular momentum is in physical quantity if the derivative of angular momentum is zero we know that whose derivative is zero that is the derivative of constant is zero it means that here the angular momentum should be constant and angular momentum is conservative and it will be shown and it will be proved according to mathematical relation that is the r vector r vector is equal to derivative of uh, uh, the derivative of angular momentum capital l is equal to zero change in angular momentum is constant that is the derivative of constant is zero and hence that l vector is the angular momentum about the origin and that will be the uh, the origin is the central force field or the or the center of the force field uh, and that will be uh, shown here and therefore l is equal to constant constant abaga when the particle moves under the central force field its momentum angular momentum l vector is conserved uh, in another language l vector remain constant it means that when the particle is a particle is under the influence of the central force field and that mass of the particle is moving around the around the origin in in its uh, orbit in its uh, orbit or in its path that will be that will be tracing in uh, three dimensional uh, three dimensional uh, uh, three dimensional field of the central force field and that momentum angular momentum should be constant that is l vector should be constant it means that is the angular momentum is conserved and it will be proved from this mathematical relation again see here again see here that is l is remain constant in the magnitude remain constant in magnitude and direction Some of the torque r that any problem see here torque r pratiksha pratiksha sutar please mute yourself पार्टिकल इज जीरो कन्सिडर दैट वॉट इज द एंगुलर मुमेंटम दैट इज आर इन टू पी दैट इज मुमेंटम इन टू आर दैट इज एंगुलर मुमेंटम बट यल वेक्टर इज इक्वल टू आर वेक्टर क्रॉस पी वेक्टर where p is the linear momentum that is the linear momentum into radius vector is known as an angular momentum and taking taking the dot product apan kay karto baka doni baju cha with respect to r vector with respect to r vector the dot product of both side gaycha hai apan left side la kay hoil baka mitrano r vector dot l vector right side la kay hoil baka r r vector dot already kon hai tithe cross product hai kunacha r vector into linear momentum that is p vector ata kay hoil baka mitrano ikada ikada jar ujva bajula mi kay kele dot ani cross fakt replace kele dot ani cross replace replace kele mul kay jala that is r vector dot i vaji palikadcha cross tithe getla manje ha jo cross hai na ha cross ithe getla mi ha cross ithe nela ani ha dot ithe anla okay sir paste bola ke बर 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 करा करा फोन करा मला आला की हां बर हम बर 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 कदाचित मुलगी जरा विचार फोन करतो ओके ओके फ्रेंड्स देन जस्ट वी इंटरचेंज द पोजिशन ऑफ द क्रॉस एंड डॉट देन वी गेट आर वेक्टर क्रॉस आर वेक्टर डॉट पी वेक्टर एंड वी नो दैट we know that the scalar triple product scalar triple product hai and scalar triple product madhe cross ani dot apan kay kele mitrano position interchange karu shakto but r cross r r vector cross r vector it becomes zero 
then above relation right hand side become zero means the left hand side is zero manje kay milala baka r into r r cross sorry r vector dot l vector is equal to zero it means that it means that that is the r vector and l vector may be in perpendicular position te kase asle pahije नॉर्मल टू इच अदर और परपेंडिकुलर टू इच अदर इफ दी आर वेक्टर क्रॉस आर वेक्टर इज इक्वल टू जीरो आर वेक्टर फ्रेंड्स सी दिस सेंटेन्स दी आर वेक्टर इज परपेंडिकुलर टू कॉन्स्टंट वेक्टर यल वेक्टर दैट इज द मोशन ऑफ द मोशन ऑफ द पार्टिकल टेक्स प्लेस इन अ प्लेन इन अ सेंट्रल फोर्स फील्ड इट मीन्स दैट दैट इज द एंगुलर मोमेंटम is conserved with respect to time this will be uh, this is uh, uh, proved actually with respect to mathematical relation then the third one is the third one is the aerial velocity is the constant or the aerial aerial velocity is conserved uh, and that will be assumed here friends here that is conservation of the aerial velocity let o be the central force field see this diagram see this diagram properly this is the o o is the center of center or it will be known as an origin an origin of the central force field then we know that at this point there is a particle with the mass m and it will be traveling around the central uh, uh, it will be it will be uh, it will be affected by the central force field it will be under the under the influence of the central force field and due to that it will be traveling it will be rotating around the center origin o in this path kiwa on this path it will be travel from a to b and due to this traveling the radius vector will be changed from r originally r to dr plus it will be changed to r plus dr plus these both are vector r vector plus dr vector at a b oa is the r vector ob is the ob is the r vector plus dr vector means the vector magnitude will be changed by the dr vector see here this is the area this is the area area is equal to we know that one of r vector into dr vector see here again let o be the center of the force we see it when the vector r is changes from r plus change in r change is delta r and in the language of derivative it will be uh, said as dr that is r will be changed by the slight changed slight positive changed it will be increased increased by slight r in time dt we know that when t is equal to 0 the point mass is at a in in time t it will be traveling to point b it will be travel from a to b and that will be the dr traveling we know that the radius vector will be changed from r to r plus dr this is the vector quantity hence vector is shown at the top of the r and dr then the area swept by the radius vector area swept by the radius vector from going a to b see here that uh, point mass is traveling from a to b from here to here this change will be the curve that is the dr and this is the radius vector r vector and at b this radius vector is r vector plus dr vector then the area swept by area swept by area that will be shown by the underlined or the lined uh, space this will be the darkened space that darkened space is the area and area that will be the small area and small area will be shown by the da da vector is equal to 1/2 r into dr vector r into dr vector then see here the area swept in time dt therefore dividing both the side the side of the equation by dt versus a area se equation hai tacha doni bajula dt na baga ujya bajula kay hoil da vector by dt hoil palikarcha bajula kay hota baga 
आर वेक्टर इंटू डी आर होत मित्रांनो डी आर ला डी टी न भागलं त्यामुळे डी आर वेक्टर बाय डी टी झालं जरा बारकाईनं बघा आणि चेंज इन डी आर वेक्टर बाय डी टी म्हणजे विलॉसिटी आहे मित्रांनो चेंज इन रेडियस चेंज इन रेडियस वेक्टर म्हणूया डी आर विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू डी टी म्हणजे काय मिळालं विलॉसिटी मिळाली त्यामुळे डी आर बाय डी टी ला मी व्ही पुटअप केलं मला रिलेशन मिळालं वन हाफ आर वेक्टर इंटू व्ही वेक्टर मिळालं व्ही विलॉसिटी सुद्धा ही वेक्टर आहे डायरेक्शन आहे त्याला मित्रांनो ओके विच इज इक्वल टू आता मी काय केलं बघा मित्रांनो इथं अंशाला आणि छेदाला यम न गुणलं यम न गुणलं आणि भागलं म्हणजे काय फरक पडेल का काही फरक पडणार नाही एक दुतांश आर डिवायडेड बाय टू यम झालं आणि व्ही च्या ऐवजी यम व्ही घेतलं मी यम न गुणलं आणि यम न भागलं काही फरक पडणार नाही वन अपॉन टू यम मी कॉन्स्टंट घेतलं कंसात काय उरलं बघा बाहेर घेतलं मी कंसात उरलं आर वेक्टर इंटू यम व्ही आणि मास इंटू विलॉसिटी म्हणजे काय झालं लिनियर मोमेंटम झालं लिनियर मोमेंटम म्हणजे पी वेक्टर बरोबर यम इंटू व्ही वेक्टर झालं मित्रांनो त्यामुळे यम इंटू व्ही वेक्टर ला मी काय पुटअप केलं पी पुटअप केलं मला इक्वेशन काय मिळालं बघा आर वेक्टर क्रॉस पी वेक्टर डिवायडेड बाय टू यम मिळालं आर वेक्टर डिवायडेड बाय पी वेक्टर सॉरी आर वेक्टर इंटू क्रॉस पी वेक्टर डिवायडेड बाय टू यम मिळालं खाली जाऊया थोडासा बदल करतोय बघा मी आर वेक्टर आर वेक्टर आहे पण इथं बाहेर जर बघितलं तर काय आहे मित्रांनो याचं डेरिव्हेशन आहे आर वेक्टर इन क्रॉस पी वेक्टर आहे डिवायडेड बाय टू यम आहे इथं आर वेक्टर बरोबर आपल्याला माहित आहे काय आलं इथं मागाशी डीएल वेक्टर आलेलं आहे आणि त्याला मी पुटअप केलं मित्रांनो पुटअप केल्यामुळे आपल्याला काय मिळालं बघा दॅट इज डीएल वेक्टर डिवायडेड बाय टू यम मिळालं आता इथं बारकाईनं बघा डी ए वेक्टर बाय डी टी गिव्ह द एरियल विलॉसिटी आणि एरियल विलॉसिटी ही काय मिळते बघा सांगा दॅट इज द यल इज द अँग्युलर मोमेंटम आहे आणि अँग्युलर मोमेंटम कॉन्स्टंट आहे आपल्याला माहिती आहे अंश कॉन्स्टंट होणार आहे छेदात काय आहे टू यम मास कॉन्स्टंट आहे टू कॉन्स्टंट आहे म्हणजे टू यम कॉन्स्टंट होणार आहे उजव्या बाजूचा अंश कॉन्स्टंट आहे कारण अँग्युलर मोमेंटम आहे छेद कॉन्स्टंट आहे कारण टू यम आहे मित्रांनो अंश कॉन्स्टंट छेद कॉन्स्टंट म्हणजे उजवी बाजू सगळीच्या सगळी कॉन्स्टंट होणार आहे डाव्या बाजूला एरियल विलॉसिटी आहे कारण डी ए वेक्टर बाय डी टी आहे दॅट इज द एरिया चेंज इन एरिया आहे दॅट इज द एरियल विलॉसिटी आहे दॅट इज एरिया स्वेप्ट बाय द रेडियस वेक्टर मिळतोय आणि एरिया स्वेप्ट बाय द रेडियस वेक्टर अंडर द अंडर द इन्फ्लुएन्स ऑफ द सेंट्रल फोर्स फील्ड दॅट विल बी नोन एज अन एरियल विलॉसिटी आणि इथं एरियल विलॉसिटी डाव्या बाजूला दाखवलं जातं उजव्या बाजूला कॉन्स्टंट आहे म्हणजे आपल्याला काय म्हणता येईल सांगा मित्रांनो एरियल विलॉसिटी इज द कॉन्स्टंट इट मीन्स द थर्ड प्रॉपर्टी ऑल प्रॉपर्टी वन टू थ्री फॉर द सेंट्रल फोर्स फील्ड आर टू बी सॅटिस्फाईड बाय द सेंट्रल फोर्स फील्ड पार्टिकल मीन्स दॅट इफ द पार्टिकल इज इन्फ्लुएन्स्ड बाय द एनी मास ऑर एनी पार्टिकल दॅट पार्टिकल हाव टू सॅटिस्फाय ऑल दीज थ्री प्रॉपर्टी and here we mathematically proved that all these three property are satisfied here by the particle having mass m jo mass m cha jo central force field madhe particle hai jacha radius vector r hai tyana matra ya teen cha teen property kay kelele hai mitrano teen cha teen property it satisfy kelele hai tyamule central force field it satisfy hot mitrano evda aplyala grahit dharav lagel kay adchan hai ka ya point madhe mitrano काही अडचण आहे नाही सर ओके 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 थँक्यू पुढे जाऊया आपण देर आर दी केपलर्स लॉ यु नो दॅट द केपलर्स देर आर द थ्री केपलर्स लॉ द फर्स्ट अँड सेकंड लॉ आपण बघणार आहे आणि थर्ड लॉ हा डिरेक्टली कशाशी संबंधित आहे मित्रांनो दॅट इज द प्लॅनेटरी सिस्टमशी संबंधित आहे आणि तो थोडासा एक्सप्लेन करायला वेळ लागेल तो आपण पुढच्या लेक्चरला एक्सप्लेन करणार आहे यु नो दॅट दी जॉन्सन क्लेपलर विच वॉज गेव दी Uh, best contribution for the planetary system and uh, he gave uh, he invent the three planetary law and that will be popular with the kepler's law and kepler's first law that is the law of elliptical orbit that is the the orbit that will be uh, that will be the path of the planetary motion or the planets it will be orbit and that orbit having the elliptical sh shape not a circle or not a circular shape it will be elliptically shape 
and it was mathematically proved mm -hmm. and that law will be uh, famous with the Kepler's law that law gives the law of elliptical orbit all the planets move in elliptical orbit with the sun situated at the foci of the ellipse you know that ellipse and one of the foci of the ellipse and at the foci the sun is present and all the planets are rotating around the uh, sun in the elliptical orbits that is the shape uh, shape or the orbit which was uh, uh, which uh, in which the uh, planet is moving that is that that shape is elliptical shape not a circle not a circular not a sphere but it is the elliptical shape and this was first proved by kepler hence the law is the law of elliptical orbit all the planets move in elliptical orbit with the sun is situated at the one of the foci of the ellipse and this is known as the law of elliptical orbit friends all these three three laws are uh, asked for the five mark uh, to uh, yeah, to write uh, short questions that is the explain in brief the three kepler's law for planetary motion that is the first law is the law of elliptical orbit and second law that will be just seen that is the law of area we know that the law of area that is the aerial velocity aerial velocity is the constant or the the law of area that is the area which was swept by the radius vector in same time are same that is the second law law of area summary like the radius vector from the sun to the planet sweeps sun to the planet that is sun is at the origin and the planet is the particle with having the mass m in above example where the planet is situated that is the earth is situated any other planet is situated at the particle who is having mass m that is the radius vector from the sun to the planet uh, swept equal area in equal time we know that that is the the radius vector swepting uh, the equal area for the equal time the aerial velocity of the planet or the area swept by the radius vector uh, per unit time is constant and that is known as the equal law of equal area here we say that this is the sun this is the earth see here he, this is the earth the radius vector is the r vector and in time t in time t that is the earth is traveling from position a to b this area will be swept again again in time t it will be swept for the position c and this area at this both area in same time they will be equal means that the equal area will be swept by the radius vector in equal time and this is the law of the area and it shows that that is the area velocity of the uh, yeah, of the radius vector is the same in case of the kepler law and third law friends we just uh, give the definition we see the definition of the third law that is the law of period and period we know that the periodic time uh, required for the uh, orientation with the uh, or the revolution around the sun it will be the same the square of see here the square of the time period of the revolution of the planet is proportional to the cube of a major axis of the ellipse and uh, this uh, law this law of the law of period we have to explain and that will be explained in the next point 1.5 see here the square of a periodic time that is t square that is the square of periodic time of the revolution of the planet is proportional to cube of a ma semi major axis you know that in ellipse there are the two axis that is the semi major axis one and other is the semi minor axis here semi major axis is the oa is the semi major axis and ob is the semi minor axis you know that that is t square is a, is cube of, is proportional to cube of a semi major axis that is oa sa cube la to proportional asel ani he aplyala kay karaycha mitrano bagaycha that is we have to prove the law of periods ani ha jo prove karnar ahe to apan next period la prove karuya okay to friends we are stopping here uh, meanwhile please uh, submit your attendance in chat box and if you have any confusion in this period in this topic then please ask me first the time remaining is very very small 2 minutes are remaining please send your attendance in chat box in 2 minute and if you have any confusion any not understanding of concept then please ask me
फ्रेंड्स प्लीज सेंड अटेंडेंस इन चैट बॉक्स फ्रेंड्स चैट बॉक्स इज वेटिंग फॉर द अटेंडेंस कुणाला काही शंका असेल तर तोपर्यंत विचारा मित्रांनो कुणाला काही शंका आहे का श्वेता पल्लवी आकांक्षा सानिका गाटगे काय शंका आहे प्लीज सेंड युअर अटेंडन्स इन चैट बॉक्स लास्ट अटेंडन्स पृथ्वीराज सौगले शंका है का पृथ्वीराज मजा आवाज ये नहीं का आवाज ये तो हाँ बहुतेक म्यूट ऑल के लिए आकांक्षा बोल ओके फ्रेंड्स जरा बोला कौन बोलते बुया अनम्यूट करा नहीं बोला हा रोहित बोल अरे रोहित अनम्यूट कर केला होता सत्ता अंजली बोल रोहित काही शंका आहे रोहित रोहित ओके ओके माझा आवाज येत होता रोहित माझा आवाज येत होता ज्याने अटेंडन्स दिला नाही त्याने अटेंडन्स द्या आणि लिहुआ ओके धनश्री प्रगती स्नेहल पाटील अश्विनी अर्जुन काय प्रॉब्लेम नो सर ओके थँक्यू धनश्री स्वरूपा फ्रेंड्स 